Deadly Court caught up with DaVinci Demon star Blake Ritson at New York Comic Con, and we're bringing you the exclusive interview. All right, your character saw what I think was the most development of any character in season two, right? We went from this antagonist to this kind of moral gray area. Yeah. And uh, will that continue in season three? Because it seems like you're being brainwashed or something at the end. Your it, character, I it mean. It does continue. I mean, I think this season, it's really morally complex. I think the whole yeah. universe, I think all the characters are put through the ringer. They're knocked off their pedestal, and I think this... There's no neat little barometer of good and evil anymore. Um, and I, I think Riari was very much at the centre of that kind of crossroads of trying to work out... You know, I think essentially, he, you know, right from the beginning, he's considered himself to be this crusader for good. He's always wanted to essentially save the world uh, in his own kind of egotistical way. So I think he is in a particularly dark place this year. And he's, you know, he's in search of a new reason to live. He's in search of a God who will answer his pleas. And it takes him into some pretty hairy situations. It gets messy. Is it more fun to play a character who's... Um, Hell yeah. Yeah, like of that. course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love... I mean, the unpredictability of the show is a wonderful gift. You know, I actively look forward to each script uh, coming through and you never really know where the character... I think this year, Riario doesn't even know where he's heading. Um, he's kind of making up as he goes along, which is having gone from someone who is almost a religious fundamentalist and has such a strong underpinning, it's pretty exciting. Uh, will we see the losses he suffered in season two continue to affect him in season three? Yeah, I think we will. I think, you know, He's been through so much, you know, he's killed his mother, he's killed his girlfriend, he's uh, failed to find any redemption, he's tried to kill himself, he's, he's done so much, I think he's absolutely plagued by guilt, um, and he's looking for some kind of redemption, which is sadly lacking, and I, I think it turns him inside out, it's, um, yeah, it's fun, right. fun, deep, gritty stuff. Excellent, man, thank you for your thank time. Thank you, thank you very much, lovely to meet you.